In this video, we are going to discuss about the number system. So let's first see what a number system is. The technique to represent and work with the numbers is called a number system. The number system that we use in our everyday life is called a decimal number system. However, there are other number systems like binary number system, octal number system and hexadecimal number system. We will be discussing all these number systems in our further videos. However, currently let's just start with the decimal number system. Decimal number system has 10 numbers 0 to 9, 0, 1, 2, 3, 4 till 9 and it is a positional value system. What does being a positional value system mean? It means that every digit, the value of every digit will depend upon the position that it holds. Let me take an example and tell you. See, there are three numbers, 734, 971 and 207. As you can see, the digit 7 occurs in all three of them. However, the value will of 7 will be different in all of them. In 734, the value of 7 is 700. 7 into 10 to the power of 2. In 971, the value is 7 into 10 to the power of 1. In 207, the value of 7 is 7 into 10 to the power of 0. So, here it is 2, here it is 1 and here it is 0. Why? Because it is a positional value system. The, every position has got a weightage which we calculate like this. Starting from the rightmost, 10 to the power of 0, 10 to the power of 1, to the power of 2, to the power of 3, 4 or 5 and this will go on. So, here in 734, the position of 7 is second, 0, 1, 2. So, 7 into 10 to the power of 2. This is how the positional number system works. Now, when we talk of a computer system, it understands only zeros and ones. Why? Because when we talk of a computer system, we can only talk in terms of electrical signals. Now, implementing 10 different digits as different voltages is very difficult. So, we need to have some other number system using which we can work with computers. In our next video, we are going to discuss another such number system which is the binary number system.